make sure to stand till the end. One simple mistake guys when replacing recirculation electric water pump can practically destroy your engine. Hey guys, welcome back. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel. Today will be a super helpful video to any V having a Mercedes C-Class guys. Okay, I'm talking generation 2007 to 2014, 15. If you have one of those and you're trying to find guys the recirculating water pump, this is the electric water pump. Stay with us, we'll explain where it's located. Even though we're demonstrating on a four-cylinder engine, the procedure may be very similar for a six-cylinder engine. We'll explain about common mistake people make when replacing uh, the water pump that can actually destroy your engine. So make sure you stay until the end or that will be covered in this video today. Before we start, let me just tell you a little bit about us guys. Every single car we get here at the garage, we try to make at least two to 300 free repair videos. We constantly guys get new cars, we take them apart, engines, transmission, bodywork. Why we do all that? Because our mission in the shop is to save you guys as much money as we can. All we need guys in return, please subscribe to the channel, like the video, that way we can keep making these absolutely free videos. And if you guys need to buy any parts, tools for your Mercedes or car at a really good price and quick shipping, check out the link in the description of the video below, that's where we get all our two supplies from and you can guys save a ton of money let's start on it now so where is the water pump located guys let's explain that now we have a special uh, video about uh, uh, complete water pump replacement uh, you can check it out this is the engine that we'll be demonstrating on if you see that's your coolant tank when guys replacing water pumps you always have to drain the coolant do that only when the vehicle is absolutely cold guys if it's hot it can severely burn you and you can okay get injured guys always use original uh, coolant or uh, approved by Mercedes coolant, ours is right here, Mercedes up to 2014 because otherwise if you put the wrong coolant, all the hoses, coolant, gaskets, okay, pumps can uh, practically be destroyed. So you have to make sure you use the right one. Uh, something else, okay, if you look right here, you have a pump driven by the serpentine belt, but that's a mechanical pump. The electric one, we're talking about that one right here, made by Bosch. This is a recirculating water pump right here, guys. Uh, in order to replace it, you need to drain the coolant. Later, after you replace it, we will, guys, you will need to uh, bleed the cooling system. If you don't, you may end up with an air pocket uh, in the engine, and that can cause coolant not to flow correctly through the engine, which will overheat the engine, and practically, guys, you may destroy your engine completely or uh, need the engine rebuilt. So uh, check out, we'll have videos guys how to bleed cooling system and it will talk all about that. If you want to see how to uh, manually activate the electric water pump on Mercedes, we'll be making a video very, very, uh, very soon. It will teach you how to do that so you can test yours if it's working or not. Hopefully the video will be helpful. Thank you for watching. See you next time.